y'all, it's LaVon. Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, I'll be showing you five ways to wear a poof or a puff, whatever you prefer. With natural hair, it's always nice to have an easy go-to for hairstyles. Of course, the bun is always the first go-to, but lately I've been enjoying my poof. The nice thing about this is you can dress it up or you can dress it down. I've struggled a little bit with my natural hair transition when it comes to dressing up for special events because my hair is not quite where I want it to be yet, but the poof is really nice. I'm an event planner and I actually rocked it at a recent wedding. I'll link that here. So we're working with kind of old hair. It's a few days old. Uh, old wash and go we're going to be using extreme styling gel you need your water bottle I'll be using these two products from the melanin line the leave-in conditioner and the pure oil blend and then I got my two favorite brushes my wire brush and my hard bristle brush got my edge brush and my edge control Oh yeah, and my water. I'm trying hard, y'all. I've been doing pretty good. Staying hydrated. So this is my favorite band. I talked about this in my other video about my natural hair journey. I'm gonna need this. And I also have my larger band. I love combining the two of these. Now, it's okay to use one or the other, but you get more of a sleek look with both. So I'm starting by hydrating and wetting, moisturizing the hair with water. And then I'm going to go in with my melanin leave-in conditioner. Get that worked in. I'm going to add my oil. And work that through there. And now we're going to go with the gel and we're going to go around the edges. Complete front and the complete back as well. Yeah, I know how I am about these edges. <laughs> so you're gonna grab your bands. I'm gonna go ahead and put mine around my neck so they're in place to use. Take my hard bristle brush and pull the hair into position of the hairstyle. Take your first band, pull it up, puff it out. Second band, I double it and then pull and get things into a neat position. And then you wanna just go ahead and just kind of play around with your puff. Get those edges brushed up. And take your edge control and just kind of refine those edges. You can get fancy if you want to. I don't do too much to mine, but some people get really fancy and it's cute, but yeah, I'm pretty basic. on to style number two. We're going to take that poof to the side. You can use whatever side you prefer. And pull your band on. I'm talking to my son here and trying to do my video. <laughs> They're always interrupting me. <laughs> and then add your double band just for a sleeker, tighter look. And then get those edges perfected. Number 
number three is basically the same as style number two, but we're gonna just get rid of the part. I love the wire brush because it pulls things into place without ripping your hair out. So add your first band and push the hair where you want it to be. And then your second double bands. I pulled it a little closer to the front of my face, towards my face rather. And on to the next. For this one, we're going to kind of pull things away from the face. Take the action to the back. And again, you can get fancy with your edges. I didn't, but yeah. <laughs> I got pieces of my sweater in my hair, so don't mind that. <laughs> I love the sweater, but it sheds. And on to our final style. This is nice for dressing up. If you have a special event to go to, just pull your band over that little rubber band there. Push the hair up. Ugh, these pieces of lint from the sweater. All right, so I really prefer to use these gold ornaments here when you do this hairstyle. That's what's really cute up there in that top area, but I didn't have any at home, so I just threw that barrette up there, but yeah. There you have it.